What is happening? Hi mate, just wanted to thank you again for the marketing advice. I've had to stop posting for a while as I can't keep up with the inquiries. Thanks again, Lee. Ooh, that's a good one. Or how about this one? Evening mate, over the weekend, another two clients requested rates and price up a site and another inquiry this evening. So that's the new site secured meeting the client there on Wednesday. That's just two of the messages we've received to say thank you for the work that we're doing with, con with contractors, right? I've had over 200 messages in the past, probably four months, four or five months, of contractors that are frustrated, overwhelmed, annoyed, pissed off, paying companies like Tenderlist for leads and getting nowhere and not winning any work because you are a name on a piece of paper or on an email, all right? Until you build your social presence, you've got no value at the negotiation stage. And that's what this channel's about, right? So from now on, this channel is gonna be brimming to the, uh, sorry, it's gonna be overflowing with marketing advice for construction companies and construction businesses to get ahead, yeah? Like, subscribe, all of that. We've got a two hour journey, or an hour and a half journey uh, to Milton Keynes, and I'm gonna explain to you how those guys got ahead in a really short space of time, and why all of our full-time clients are getting ahead and making thousands of pounds more profit, all right? This stuff ain't difficult. Um, it's not that hard to get ahead in construction if you get this stuff right. Let's do this. The world's worst transition. Come on. The reality of... Um... Forgetting batteries, forgetting... Flipping... Charges. Come on, let's go. It's the reality of being a uh, human, I've really zoomed in, like, you human being stay and there. a businessman. No, you're. Mate, no, you stay there. It it's was fine. fine. It still is fine. You're still recording. How the f are you going to record if you're the one looking at the screen? You didn't need to swear, that was going to be part of the video, but it's fine. Got lost twice following a sat nav. Has anybody else used a sat nav as a suggestion? I've never seen so many builders in one place. First met Amber and I first saw Amber actually when she was on the hod. I know you wouldn't believe it, would you? Wouldn't believe it. These guys are now part of the master marker. 250 quid for the whole year. And I'll let you tell everybody, Amber, what's included. Oh my god. We were stuck. We had no idea what to do. Um, everything that we thought our business was <laughs> what to do. We went with Lee and Helen, we've sucked it all off. Uh, and then we're starting again. So they're Ta telling us how to do our business properly, LinkedIn, social media, the works. So Right, Carl, now it's your turn. <laughs> What's your business name and what do you do? Come on. Uh, Lockley Brickworks, so I'm a reclaimed contractor. Where are you based? Uh, based in Birmingham. Yeah. Uh, manufacturing online extensions for the minute. Yeah. Uh, Where are you going? Hopefully, developments like house new build taxes. Yeah, like that, definitely. If you have any new builds or developments in the West Midlands, Lucky Brickworks is your company. I tell everybody to get in front of camera, don't we? All of the time. Get in front of camera, no one's doing it in construction. Amber has got the gift of the gab. You will be seeing Amber on Instagram, definitely, and probably YouTube. I'm going to badger them now. They've got no excuses. And they've got all the, uh, all the information they need in the Master Bar car. Carl, got chatting, he's only got a picture of me on his stand, how about that? Check him out there. Harris Brick Safety Systems, you heard it here first. Yes, yeah, so I'll tell you all of the time, solve problems, solve your client's problems. Bloody genius. Goes on your hip, put your trowel on it, and I was just saying to this man here, Mike, because yep. I lose my car keys all the time, I lose my trowel all of the time, all right? I put it on the map board, go and read some drawings, come back and my trowel's gone. Well, I've forgotten where it is, it ain't, gone it, it ain't gone anywhere. That will save you time and money. He's found a problem and he's solved the problem, all right? Put your clients first. Right, this is Gary, he owns GSQ Brickwork. He's got 200 trials on. He's a maniac, he needs his head testing. <laughs> what I want to know is how you get from being a brickland apprentice to a bricklayer to having 200 bricklayers working for you. Key thing for me, my success, if you like, the, the growth, think about what my client wants. Yeah, you know, what yeah. do they want? What, who, who am I working for? What does my boss want? 
He wants me to turn up on time every day. That's the number rule. We talk one. about that all the time. It's about your clients. It's not about you. It's just about your clients. Mate. Exactly. Yeah. Is that a number one? One tip. If you said to someone, someone says, I want to be a subby, one tip, what would you tell them? Please other people, please your client. Yeah, you know, but it's but like- I just take my word for it. That's come from the horse's mouth. Yeah, <laughs> and, and, and I'm very lucky I've got, you know, like I so said, we've got 200 foot layers, probably more than that if I was counting at the moment, plus the old carries, etc. And we're quiet at the moment. Yeah. And it literally, I started with nothing. I started with a blank piece of paper. The only in was I had family in the game. Yeah, you know? yeah, so, yeah. Um, Watch the space. Listen, Gary's got a lot of stuff going on with apprentices, something that we're interested in as well. So sure there'll be some more collaborations, all right? No shoes. <laughs> right, and yeah. then that's it, yeah, go on. That's not my Charlie Bosco. That's it. There you go, look. Go on. Can you can bake a cake. There you go, and then down. Still positive. Oh, so nobody. Have you got a muck on the bed? Oh, Seconds to that last brick. <laughs> Good but slow. <laughs> oh, you're two. It's over. There's a winner. There's a clear winner. Yeah, there's a shit and What a prize, what a day. We, 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 we used to say on site, he's slow, but fuck me, he's rough. <laughs> Helen won the Super Trail. It's great to meet Amber and um, Kyle as well. You know, there's a. There's a Super fail. <laughs> There's a, listen, there's a correlation. Everyone that's doing well, that's our client, right, is lovely. I think Kyle and, and Amber are a great example of that. All of our full-time agency clients are exactly the same. They're really nice people. Uh, and there's a perception in construction that you've got to be a bastard to get ahead, and it's just not true. Um, you know, we, we uh, showed up with Thames Valley Brickwork with service, right? Everywhere we went, I was like, how can we help? How can we be of service? What more can we do? I'd always try and go above and beyond. And that is a definitely a pattern with everybody that we're working with, right? Um, the other thing is communication. Now, if someone sends you a tender, get it back as quickly as possible. Tell them when you're going to send it back, all right? And exceed their expectations, all right? That definitely stands you in good stead. And if you communicate effectively in an industry where nobody communicates effectively, you get ahead. And they're all really, really good at their job, all right? It's all right getting in front of people. It's all right winning the work. It's all right getting the numbers right. Um, but if you if you are not good at your job and you don't execute on what you say you're going to execute on it's only a matter of time before it all goes south okay so listen like i said like subscribe all that it's been a wicked day we've made loads of good contacts and to be fair even all of the um stalls that we spoke to a lot of those people are struggling with their marketing too so it's not just you that or you guys that are struggling to get in front of potential clients okay it's everybody in our industry you lot are brilliant at what you do but there's a massive gap in uh, I guess knowledge to get in front of the right people and that's where this channel comes in all right I'm going to tell you everything you need to know on this channel like subscribe all that good stuff and Helen's going to say goodbye goodbye you put your fires in my way do it again then goodbye see you later <laughs>